All right, so on this play, second and one, we knew they were going to take a shot. Um, it's a waste down for a lot of offenses where they just try to get a big play off the bat. So we call it a fire zone from the field. John Prince does a really good job. We talk all the time. Coach T. Ward does a really good job of talking about entry angle, just the angle to the quarterback's path. And uh, he just runs his line, stays on that same line. He's the edge rusher and runs him right into the quarterback. He beats the puller to the point of attack. Um, you know, this was one of those ones from the sideline, just standing there. I could see it. As soon as he got off, he jumped the snap, and his angle was perfect. I knew there wasn't a shot pretty much immediately on this play. Yeah. Uh, just just a good get off, uh, great read by by JP. I call him JP. Uh, get to the quarterback, recognizing the play action, uh, recognizing the puller, the full slide uh, with, with the puller and coming back and protecting it and getting to the quarterback. Yeah, so Ruben's obviously a really smart player, a really versatile player. Coach Tip does a good job of letting him understand his leverage. He's never going to beat himself uh, by just knowing where he's supposed to be, um, knowing where his help is. And in this going again, going in this game, we weren't going to let two beat us. Um, and then so they hit his own replay with the quarterback pulling it. We knew he was an athletic guy, had experience at this level, and uh, was a mobile guy. So just Ruben having that awareness and taking a good angle, using his leverage and running through that hip, uh, and just having a sure tackle on quarterback a big play in the game, you know, not getting out of leverage forcing it back to himself if, if needed. Yeah, uh, great play by Ruben. Uh, great open field tackle. Could have easily been a, a 20 or 30 yard run if, if he didn't uh, use his technique to the, to the best of his ability. Uh, great eyes, great read. He did his job and he made a play. Uh, all right, so here uh, we have been we have been rushing a, a bit. This this was the end of the first half, I believe. So so we have been rushing a bit, and I have been setting up my moves, and, and I know. Uh, usually teams like to work on too many drives at the end of in the halves, in the quarters, uh, unless they're up big at the end of the game. So, uh, so here I, I was in a two eye. Um, I, I come off, I, I give them a little little head fake, uh, stutter step with my feet, and then I, I, I show them my inside hand, uh, which we call a flash. And I get get into my cross top, and I, I see I keep my move tight. That way I can rip through, and he has no way to recover, and, and then I get my first second of the game. Yeah, we talk about working the edges all the time, and you know, there's not a better player um, in Division One at getting to an edge and rushing the quarterback than the man sitting next to me. That's what he does. He makes it look easy, but it's a hard thing to do to get your hips up out of there, so you're not rushing down the middle of someone, and then uh, being able to finish, like he said, tight to the lineman, so he can't recover and place his hands back on him. And uh, and most important thing is finishing. Uh, here, uh, coming out of halftime, we we have been moving a lot. So so here, I believe it was a Texas, but uh, just just my awareness coming in coming into play. I, uh, he had been leaning leaning pretty hard on my uh, stunt step. So so as I go across, I, I kind of give him a, a, another kind of cross chop. And, and once I feel him lean, uh, I use his pressure against him, and I throw my spin, uh, high elbow, uh, back of the head to make sure he, he can't recover, and make sure I keep my hips. Uh, get my hips turned all the way and accelerate to the quarterback. A lot of pass rushes working off of each other. You know, Marlon Taylor does a good job of keeping the double team to himself here, so they can't pop off and get back on D Max if they were to slide to him. Um, but you know, this is another example of just feel. Pass rush is all about feel and, and realizing the type of set that you're getting versus a certain offensive lineman. This guy sets hard to the inside. And uh, again, working edge, D-Max getting to the opposite edge on spin, feeling where he's at with the quarterback's width of the pocket and getting a nice finish. Party at the, party at the depth of the quarterback.